morning, Hank. It's Tuesday. Good morning, John. Oh, he's... I'm also here. It's a reunion video where two brothers talk to you about God. We went to see a stand-up comedian last night, and she... One of the hypotheticals was, what would you do if you were God for 15 minutes? Yeah. And you said, that's what our video should be about during the intermission. We, oh, I did wait for the intermission. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. You made it sound like I was like, I was like, shut up, stand-up comedian. I've got an idea. I know what I would do first. In my first three I know, seconds. I know what you would do first. I would eliminate tuberculosis yeah. and other infectious diseases. All infectious diseases? Pretty much. Although, I might leave a little bit of the common cold. Just for a, like, to... Just so people have a memory of building. what it used to be like to be sick. But I would eliminate all serious infectious diseases, even though it would be catastrophic for my new book, Everything is Tuberculosis. <laughs> <laughs> I'd have to update it really fast. Yeah. Aging is no longer a thing. You go full vampire. You're going full Twilight. Yeah, I feel like you, you hit 30 and that's what you're going to be. No. No, I like aging. I don't know. Well, I don't want to get rid of aging. You okay? The, but you I do. I want to get rid of aging look, at some point. You, yeah, you, you age, age until you get to your full handsomeness at forty-seven. <laughs> I'm worried about unintended consequences. Yeah. So I, but I do have an obvious answer. Okay. That solves so many problems very quickly. Great, I love it. Which is that the maximum, like a tall person, mm -hmm. you'll be like that person is so tall mm -hmm. should be four feet tall. Oh, because then we consume fewer resources. Yes. We're, we're easier to ship around on airplanes. Oh, so easy. Cars would be smaller. We could fit so many people on roads. The price of houses would come way down. Any new building People would be, would be like six foot ceilings. <laughs> what yeah. am I going to do with all it's, the space? There would be enough of everything for everyone immediately. Everybody is four feet tall. No, four feet is tall. So a lot of people are three six. Yeah. Yeah, three three. Uh huh. Even yeah. three three. But it's between it's between three and four, and like four foot four people are like basketball players. Right. Right. It wouldn't be bad for basketball because we would just adjust the hoops accordingly. So many more people could go to the games. A third of the consumption. Fewer cells, so you probably live longer. You get less cancer. Like a like a chihuahua d lives longer than a mastiff. How are we going to bring about world peace in fifteen minutes as God? Well, if everyone were four feet tall. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that would fix the wars. Uh, no. Hank had a proposal for this last night, which I thought was pretty brilliant, which is that if you hurt someone, it hurts you. The exact same amount. The, like, like, it, it just, just feels the same. And if you, if, and, and Sarah was like, well, if you kill someone, do you die? And I was like, no, it just hurts really bad. Forever. Like, it's yeah. like chronic pain. What if I say, hey, you go kill that person? Then you, you get more pain. Oh, okay. Or at least as much pain. But what if I didn't orderer. really mean it? Well, that's not, well, you will quickly learn not to mess around with such talk. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Or, you know, I'm God and I know if you meant it. But I'm only God for 15 minutes. So I've got to set up a, a system a of system rules that very knows quickly. whether you mean it. Here's my worry. Yeah. What if I, because in the, in the future world where uh, there is no aging yeah. and you only die of like falling off of a ladder, mm. what if I hire someone to like clean my gutters for me yeah. and then he falls off the ladder yeah. and then I have to experience the pain because that was my fault. And the guilt. Then I think you just got to get rid of death. Okay. And but pain. Th but, but if you no get... No pain. That's a problem. Unless you cause other people pain. But they can't, you can't. Oh boy. See, this is now we've, we're getting in the we've weeds. We've ended war because now you can't kill anybody. You're not allowed to hurt anybody. Or put them in prison. Oh, yeah, you definitely can't. Yeah. Well, now that's a problem. And you can't do anything bad. You You're not allowed to be naughty. You're not allowed to be naughty. Any naughty, even financial naughty, pain. Yeah. <laughs> I'm starting to worry about this. I I'm starting to too. think that actually being God would be kind it's of hard. So hard. I'm reminded Four of Four feet tall! You've decided that this is the hill you're gonna die I on. I just think we're Not like big. world peace, not eliminating infectious disease. You're like, just shrink us down. Once you think, we'll start thinking about it, you like look at a meal and you're like, this is so much food. For the record, and I don't mean to get preachy, but uh -huh. this way of thinking about God as inherently uh, omnipotent and capable yeah. of moving all the chess pieces around is not the only way to think about God. Yeah. For the, just for the record. And There's the also Warriors the books. No. But there's also... <laughs> you got to keep that in. I will. <laughs> there's also the Dietrich Bonhoeffer quote, God is weak and powerless in the world, and that is exactly the way, the only way in which God is with us to help us. 
Which is very similar to the situation in the Warriors books, where Star Clan, mm -hmm. they cannot, they are there to guide the cats mm -hmm. in the forest, but yeah. they cannot control what happens to the cats in the forest. Hank, John, I'm glad that we're not God. I think we would be bad at it. And it's a reminder that people who do really like want to be God or want to be dictators generally are not qualified for the job inherently because wanting that is weird. Yeah, and I think that the people who want that are just like incapable of having an idea that is as good as four foot tall should be tall. Yeah. And I actually mean, maybe I would be good at it. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see you on Friday.